Alright guys, welcome back to Bioshock Infinite. Um, I guess when we left off we were just going through here. While I'm moving, there's definitely some, some crap out here. Let's go ahead and check out some of this guys. Yay! AI! Really doesn't seem to notice a lot of what I do. Take some of it to respond, which is kind of nice. They let me shoot first. That guy over there is friendly. You're not, though. I think that's everybody in this room. What the hell was that? I have no idea. Anyway, I want to see your head. What are you guys? That's weird. I'm with a weird group of people. We need to take that elevator up. Bet at least to Fink's office. What have we got here? Um. Hmm. Sure. Ammo hasn't been too too much of an issue, but it has been at at times. I'll go for it. I should really get into the menu and take a look at the equipment that I actually have and try to figure out what would be the best combo here. That guy is not burning for some reason, even though he's in the fire. Alright, where's the button? There's the button. Just gonna have a silent elevator ride, you're not gonna say anything? Kinda awkward. Just saying. Just saying. So this is where they make the plasmids or the vigors or whatever the hell they are. Hmm. Where the hell are we going in here exactly? I wonder if I can get to that store that was down there. It was there for a reason, I bet. They're just right for each other, aren't they? Who? It's Rory and Comstock. Yeah, they are kind of just two two sides of the same coin, aren't they? Nice. Mainland, Mr. Lin. My God, I I was so set on getting to Paris. I didn't really think that you couldn't have known this would happen. I had a role in this catastrophe. If, if you want to pretend that we're purely innocents in this, then that's your prerogative, but... I knew the phone was going to ring because the little thing you told me. Um, uh, hello? Think? I saw you die, Booker. Saw with my own eyes. That's right. Listen, I got you your guns. I'm here for my airship. But my Booker DeWitt died for the Vox Populi. You either an imposter or a ghost. My Booker DeWitt was a hero to the cause, a story to tell your children. You, you just complicate the narrative. Great. So I'm an inconvenient truth, eh? Wonderful. So you guys aren't going to be friendly anymore, are you? Nope. Well, that's nice. Oh, everybody hates me. I want my freaking airship. I'm never gonna get to Paris. Sounds like a nice idea now. I wasn't really on board with it originally, but. Can we bust down this door? It certainly can. Oh, what do you got hiding back here? Hmm. That sounds kind of nifty. Definitely need to like just stick to something though. I'm picking out a lot of different crap. And there's not really much else going on. Actually, let's take a look at the gear section right here. Okay, spare the rod. What else have we got? I actually want to stick with that one, I think. I'll stick with that. Hmm. It's not that useful. That's kind of useful. I don't do that many 
what's it called things though. I guess we'll just stick with fit as a fiddle for now. I don't use the skylines all that much. What do we got now? That bottle's just kind of nasty looking. And it burned my hand really bad. Gave oh, gross. That's a nasty one. So we have water powers now, I gather. Poseidon something. Undertow. Wash away your enemies. Hold to grab enemies and release to reel them in for punishment. <laughs> Alright, good to know. Might as well listen to this. These holes have shown me yet another wonder, though I've yet to see the application for it. They illuminate a merger of machine and man that is somehow the lesser yet the greater of both parties. The process seems to be irreversible. <laughs> Perhaps, though, Comstock will have some need of this kind of thing to keep watch in that tower he is building. Let me see. Whatever, man. That's my other gun that I gotta set up that. What? What? Uh, what? Huh. Oh my god. Are you serious? The imposters. Burn their bodies when you're done. She is serious. I hate the firemen. Yeah, they're really far away still. I don't know how dangerous the fireman truly is from this kind of distance. But he's probably not going to stick to that distance. Did he do anything? No, they don't. Pop your head up, man. We're going to have to get up here and try to take him out this way. Do it! I can't even get up there. Right, so move, man. Where am I going? Does this just swing around again? It kind of seems to. I'd like to jump on that thing, but apparently that's not going to happen. Is somebody else alive over there? I don't think so. I missed! Let's try that again. Get up there. Let's reverse. And bam! There we go. Don't really know why I was so, like, set on doing that, but... All right, that worked out pretty well. Still looking. Get the heck out of here. Um. Damn, thought I was gonna fall there for a second. Holy moly. I could use some health more than I could use salts right now. That's crazier than I was hoping it was going to be. Get out of here. I think that killed him. Ow. Go, Booker! I don't need a handyman right now. I really don't. I'm gonna ride around a little circle for a little bit. Ah. 
Alright, that, that's awesome having force push. Can I do anything to you with this? I don't think I can. Go, 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 go. Go, I said. I'm stuck on something. Where's that Tesla coil? Is it blown up? Holy moly. I need to get up on that sky thing again. Or one of you needs to have some help, which you didn't. Which you didn't. Alright, let's try to get another one of these done here. I don't know where Elizabeth ended up right now. That didn't sound like it was my friend, though. No, you're not dead. Dear God. 